I imagine too, you know, people ask me, well, how do you work with actors? And I'm like, well, uh, there's no there's no single answer to that. You know, um, every actor is different. There are all these you know beautiful supercomputers, and and you kind of have to decode each one and figure out what they need. And I, it's my job to be malleable to what they need um, because because I have to provide them the best opportunity to give a great performance. It, it probably seems similar as a producer. You you know you probably work differently with me than you do with Chris because Chris needs different things. You know, our producing partner Sarah Green definitely worked with Terrence Malick differently than she works with me because uh, he just he needs he needs different things that's a statement that's not a question so. I think that's actually <laughs> very acute like I, I think I'm OCD with all my filmmakers but, <laughs> but I'm a right. different producer for every director because they need different things and I think part of the skill but also the fun is figuring out what each filmmaker needs from you and try to fill that box and hopefully exceed those expectations but I think we, there's a lot of pain to our job. Like finding, putting movies together basically means you're watching them fall apart over and over and over again until the, the magic sort of dust all comes together in one moment. Um, but the fun part is that we get to make, you know, a period epic and a sci-fi film and a musical and a comedy and a low budget horror and a big action movie in the same year in a way that doesn't box us in. And I yeah. think we get, to, and we get to work with amazing filmmakers and crew and cinematographers and in a way that just lets us get our, if you're a movie lover and a cinephile, which we grew up, you know, all of us can, no matter where you are in a movie chain or in the crawl, you love movies and you love stories. Yeah. And so for us to get to experience a variety of different people and places and stories is like, it's I think the one lucky, yeah. <laughs> really lucky aspect of what we well, That's a nice I, way of putting it. I will say too, what's, we've made, what, five movies together now mm -hmm. in some capacity? Yeah. It's also really strange. You have to think about this. I didn't know Chris Weitz before he read the script and fell mm -hmm. in love with it, and it and it took us some time. I, Chris is the I, I, he is sad he can't be here and he sends his regrets. He is the loveliest man and he has been doing this for a long time since about a boy, and so all and by the way he has he's produced movies before, so there is a there is a bit of this dance where you are introduced to somebody and all thrown into a boat together and sent down the rapids, mm -hmm. <laughs> do you know what I mean? And you're like, oh cool, we're all going to Argentina together? <laughs> right. I guess, all right, we'll see how this goes. It's a really weird thing to start it. You're basically like jamming together and starting a company as fast as possible and for the next 18 months living together and at the end of those 18 months, like disbanding the company like and putting the thing out and that's it. And then you don't, you know, I, I feel really lucky to have gotten to make five movies with you because you get into a rhythm and we get to go work with Adam Stone, your cinematographer, or Sarah Green, who's been my partner on all those things. And like, I actually, I, I'm starting to get good at it now. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It's harder, but, but the good news about this is this is, I'm so happy about this movie and I loved making it. And that was that is a rarity because there are plenty of movies that I've worked on before where you throw everybody in the boat and you're like, oh my God, we're either all gonna eat each other or like, <laughs> we gotta start kicking people out because it's, because it's, it's really intense to yeah. to jam everybody together, and and it's pressure filled, and yeah. so that's the fun and the nightmare of making movies.